really back Black Sabbath. You can't go eat your seeds in your wagon that I put for you. You're not much of a watchdog, are you? Look at you looking at him. Don't you do anything about it? He's not even scared. Look at him. He knows where his food comes from, don't he? You gonna let him get away with that? Huh? Huh? You gonna let him get away with that? Come on! Get him! Oh, that's not gonna scare him. Okay, today's reading. All that we are is the result of what we have thought. If a man speaks or acts with an evil thought, pain follows him. If a man speaks or acts with a pure thought, happiness follows him like a shadow that never leaves him. There's today's reading, you guys. If you guys got one of these, I, t I take the lid off now. I find that the color is more better and prettier and the steam is more better too. I don't know why it doesn't say to take that off, but I'm telling you, if you take your lid off of your steamer, I call it a steamer, I don't know. <laughs> you will, uh, Enjoy the colors. Even the water turns color. Just a tip. I'm going to get my little mess from last night cleaned up. Then we're going to head to town, you guys. What's he looking at? You're going to scare him. Ooh. Felix. He's he's hunting right now. I don't know what he sees, but... Get those mice. Get him! Probably sees a mouse. Bruce is taking him down my boards. He's off today because they have a Remembrance Day off, so. Yeah, and you've really put, you know, Remembrance you Day. You gotta is have to jobs. A, remembrance Day is a day that's supposed to be relaxation. We did that yesterday. Just, no, not yesterday. Yesterday was I Remembrance Day. I still worked day. yesterday. You still put me to work. <laughs> so we're saying. Goodbye to our boards here because Nathan's a grown man now almost and he doesn't need them anymore. Look look at what was under there, under the thing. <laughs> Nathan. <laughs> this has taught Nathan to write so many things, this whiteboard. Oh, it helps so much during our schooling. Well, he's still schooling, but he's not doing this kind of stuff anymore. So I'm going to fix up this wall. Probably not till after Christmas, but it's coming all down. I'm going to warm up as a little lunch before I go into town. Um, so I won't buy too many things. <laughs> Just buy, I'm going to try and buy what's on my list. Yeah, Michelle, we've heard that before, right? <laughs> Yeah, you guys love me though, don't you? You love me, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to have craft dinner and I think I'm just going to have one rib. And the rest will be for Bruce. I got to get Nate some Cheerios. He's having withdrawals. When we come home, I got to make some bread. You guys, we're off to town to get a couple things. Ooh, it's chilly. Not too bad though. I'm not ready to wear my winter coat yet, so I don't think I need it yet. But I bring it along just in case emergencies. cute. She should come home. I'm looking for the red and black checker like on my bed. I would love to do my tree in that for ribbon but I don't seem to have it here. But I might if I have white lights this would be really pretty wouldn't it? Hmm. Help me guys. 9.27 meters it means nothing to me. Why can't they just give me feet? 
Give me feet measurements, please. You think they'd have all this done by now? Ready for Christmas. I haven't seen one red truck thing. I've been looking and looking in these boxes and not one. Not one red truck sign or anything. So I asked the cashier, when are you guys going to get all those boxes emptied? I was looking for the red truck theme. She looked at me like I'm nuts. She said, well, I'm sure it'll get done soon, a week or so. It's real snotty. Like she was... <laughs> oh boy. I didn't mean to offend her in any way. I just wanted to find some red truck theme stuff, but that seems impossible here. So... We got a few things, so let's go to No Frills now. Music already? Did you get my message? No. Oh, I called twice saying, get the barbecue going. Uh huh. We're going to have some burgers tonight on the flame broil barbecue. Yeah. Bring in the babies for a walk. It's going to be dark any minute. Hey, what's your name? Sexy? You single? Hey, can I have come over for a cheeseburger? Yeah, you can come over for whatever you want. Time. <laughs> Look at that. Bruce will be picking that up. That's for sure. That's for sure. It's going to get dark before we get home, you guys. Yeah. Everybody's out walking. Their dogs. Yeah, he got them. He went and got them. I thought they were gone already, but Bruce was there with all his other ones that he collects. Oh, I wish they'd come back on us every year. We'll try it. We keep trying. Okay, these are the hamburgers we froze in our meat hall, remember? Remember I shaped them with my, my um, hamburger maker? Yeah. That's what's for dinner. We're going to have hamburgers and chips. You got it, baby! <laughs> I like to put some mayonnaise on ours. And some ketchup and mustard. We got crappy buns, but I want to use them up from the freezer. So they'll be out of the freezer and then... Like I said, I just want to, if we're going to need buns for burgers or anything, I'm going to uh, make them or buy them right then when we need them. No more storing them. I don't like to store bread in the freezer anymore. It takes up too much space. Yeah. Okay. Ketchup. And some lettuce. Hang on. And some lettuce. I like to put lettuce. And then I like to put a little mayonnaise on top of the lettuce, too. That's kind of big, but oh well. We're going to watch the host on the prairie, hon? No, I'll watch it in there. Oh, well, we're going to be watching the little house. On the prairie later. Okay, you won't regret it. Yeah. I know you're talking to your subscribers. Well, we're watching it later on. Well, whatever. I'm going in my room later on. In your music room. I've dedicated myself to watch Little House on the Prairie every night. Naked? <laughs> 
Stop it! <laughs> oh. Jeez. That's all right. You can watch it. I'm putting extra onion because we... You got to eat this onion because it's uh, flu season, so we want to make sure we eat our onions. I'm taking my onion off. No, you're not. You want to see it. Okay. Nate is probably going to have chicken. I don't, I got to make bread, so that's good. Otherwise, he'd have grilled cheese, probably. But he's probably going to make himself some chicken when he's hungry. That, my friends, is dinner tonight. Those buns don't do it justice, do they? Okay, guys, we are going to make some bread. And I'll show you. I'm going to clean up the kitchen here. And I'll show you uh, what I got in town. Okay, so let's get our yeast rising. And then we'll work on the bread and then we'll, and I'll show you. And we'll clean up this, these dishes up. Not too many tonight to do. Ever since I've been watching Little House on the Prairie, I felt like making bread more. Yeah. We're going to put that in the oven to rise for an hour. Because Bruce has a habit of opening the door. Okay, so we are going to make Bruce a couple hamburgers for his lunches for the next two days. And, uh, these buns are sad. But I'm going to keep them. I'm going to put peanut butter on them for the the girls outside. Peanut butter, they're peanut butter sandwiches. So, uh, I'm going to put his burger on like this. And, uh, then we're going to wrap them in our handy. Tinfoil wraps. It'll be just like a takeout burger. But it's better. Right? It's better. But it'll look like a takeout burger. And all his employees, all the other employees will be jealous. Because he has takeout burgers. <laughs> yeah. Let me show you what else I'm going to do here for him. There, we got lunches for two days. I'm going to fill up these little ketchup and mustard things for him. So he doesn't have to have it soggy. He can put it right on after he takes his hamburger out at work from the heating it up. You can put a little mustard and ketchup on it. I got these at the Dollar Tree. Yeah, Dollar Tree. I'm going to go fill them up. Okay, also, you could collect these from the uh, fast food when you eat out. These little packets, if you don't want to use those. And ask for mustard packs and they'll give them to you. Okay? Now we're going to bake up two bags of chips for him because you never know. He could eat the whole bag and have none left for his lunch. This way they're ready to go with his with his hamburgers. And then that way we just have to cut some fruit up tomorrow for his lunch. And we'll be ahead of the game, right? I'll add a little more to that bag. And we're prepared for for lunches for two days. Okay, so this is what I got at no frills. I got some cream because I want to redo my frozen hot chocolate and try something a little different. 
I wanted to use, I thought I'd get chocolate milk too, but has anybody noticed the prices of things lately? I could have, I could have probably looked on my phone and maybe price chopped it, but two ninety nine for a little thing of milk, chocolate milk. It was like, no, I'll make my own chocolate milk. I got everything I need to make chocolate milk here. So I was thinking of, instead of using white milk, cho making it chocolate, putting some Cool Whip on top. I think that'll make it a lot better. And then I wanted orange juice, but it was two ninety nine. And this was on for 89 cents, so what is this? Orange punch. Oh shoot. But and then I was I'm gonna make through some oatmeal cookies after I'm done this haul little haul here. He wanted raisin oatmeal cookies. Raisins were $4.99 for a little bag. These were $2.79, so I'm gonna put chocolate instead of raisins. Just got a couple bananas. This is just to get us through till Thursday. A bag of chips. And we got the Doritos. They didn't have the nacho Doritos that Bruce likes there today. So that's what I got at Walm at uh, No Frills. Now I'll show you what I got at the Dollar Rama. Okay, so at the Dollar Rama, I got this here for my phone at night. I like to watch videos. And I needed, I, everything I rested on it falls over, so I thought, this will work, right? <laughs> yeah, this is, uh, it's supposed to be for an iPad, right? A tablet, which I'm hoping Santa will bring me this Christmas. Maybe, maybe not, but one day. Mm -hmm. And uh, until then, I thought... This will be perfect for my phone when I go to bed at night and I watch my videos. This is nice to have. So that's what I got. And then I got two bags of cat food for Felix. He had a can of tuna this morning because I was out of cat food. And then I got this zip seal bags and it's Christmas. Christmas bags. And... I got ribbon for my tree. Now I wanted to have the buffalo pattern, you know, the red and black. I'm going to hang it down my tree. I'll show you when I do my tree. But they didn't have it, right? Like you see in my video, like I explained. So I got this pattern here. I got two of these. They didn't have four of the same, so I'm just going to do is what I got here. For these, so you better get to the dollar store if you want to do some ribbon on your trees. I got one of these, and then I got snowflakes to keep with the gold theme. I'm pretty sure my lights for my trees are white. I can't remember. And then, then I got some candy and chocolate bars. I got some of these um, cherry filled. They used to be bigger boxes, weren't they? Last year, I thought they were bigger. Uh-huh. I got some arrow, arrow bars for Nate. And... Oh, sweet tarts. And I got these little... Which we're going to have one right now. Little Ruffles, Ruffles, Stobert, um Caramel and Marshmallow. That one's a marshmallow too. I got Bruce a big Turk. And one more marshmallow. So we're going to have one of these right now. And that's what I got at Dollarama. Bruce has extra pine around. <laughs> so we might just go halfway up the wall. This is the Cheerio guy. I would, thought I left his Cheerios in the store. Where are you, Cheerio man? And uh, he he scoffed them from me. <laughs> he stole the Cheerios. <laughs> I don't think there's enough. Well, Cheerio man.
Okay, you guys. It is time for Little House on the Prairie. Hot chocolate and homemade cookies. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay, honey, try a cookie. That's a point at me. You're the taste tester. Jesus. Nat, my screen's gone. I can't see. It's pure white now. My camera's screwed. How's your hot chocolate? Mm. I'm doing it this time, okay? <laughs> mm. Come around here very often. <laughs> I haven't seen you in a while. I think that's a good sign. Mm. Say good night, hon. Night. See you guys tomorrow. Delicious. As we watch Little House on the Prairie. Good night all. My camera is messed up now. <laughs>